Hello, I'm Russ Fellows from Evaluator Group. As companies embrace new cloud-native applications across both their on-site and public cloud infrastructures, they're looking to scale the underlying components cost-effectively. Storage is an area we found that can have significant performance differences between the offerings. We were asked to compare two software-defined storage offerings, Lightbits and Ceph, using identical hardware. It's important to note that Ceph was chosen because it is well-known and can deliver good performance. The performance differences we found were dramatic, with Lightbits achieving between 2x and 16 times higher performance than Ceph, depending upon the workload. Now, there are several reasons underlying the technology for this. First, the use of Intel Optane Persistent Memory, also known as PMEM. Lightbits uses this as a write-back buffer to dramatically improve write performance. Additionally, Lightbits is designed for all solid state media, unlike Ceph, originally designed for spinning media. And finally, Lightbits is able to use NVMe over TCP to reduce network latencies. Our testing was performed using containerized applications, using a total of 96 containers running on 12 different Kubernetes worker nodes, all accessing a single Lightbits or Ceph storage cluster. We tested both storage systems using two different types of media. First was read-optimized QLC storage media and also mixed-use TLC storage media. Both Lightbits and Ceph were configured to optimally use the hardware, including the Intel persistent memory. Now, as you can see from these results, there are significant differences across the different workloads. Focusing first on QLC media, you can see that there was between a 4x advantage for 4K writes up to nearly a 17 times performance advantage for light bits with 4K writes. This is a critical component for many databases which use 4K writes for their logs and often gates the performance of many database applications. Looking at other applications using 8K, 16, and 32K uh, mixed workloads, you can see that the performance advantages range from nearly 6X to over 12X. These are very significant differences. Next, looking at use of TLC media, the differences are still very significant, although not quite as dramatic. This is because TLC media has much better write performance than QLC media. Thus, the light bits use of PMEM is not quite as dramatic of an improvement. However, you still see anywhere from 2x up to nearly a 7x performance advantage for light bits. Again, with the 6.7x performance benefit coming on the critical 4K writes. Now these are very dramatic differences, so I'd invite you to download the white paper either at evaluatorgroup.com or lightbits.com. I'm Russ Fellows for Evaluator Group. Thanks, see you next time.